hello guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is kobe and this is skytech digital now in this video i'm going to show you how i created this beautiful um library website over here so um i call this a library website because um you borrow books over here okay you don't buy books you borrow books over here now, i'm going to show you how i created this um beautiful library website as you see over here with all the um beautiful images and everything i'll give them to you for free I'll show you where you can download them. I'll leave the link in the description for you for free. So I'm going to take you through the whole website itself. It's a very simple library website. It doesn't have too many functions. All what it does is borrow a book, okay? So what we're going to see is um, a header over here with, the, um, you know, the um, library logo over here and then the menu items over here with a button to over here, okay? So as you can see, we have um, the home page, the about page, the library, the contact, and then what? The account, my account page over here. And then borrow a book, which will also lead you to what? The library over here. Now, if you scroll down, we have um, the hero session too over here. Um, with a small quote over here by Dr. Zeus. Um, I got this one on Google when I Googled to get more, um, you know, quote on uh, reading. I got this one over here. The more that you read, the more things you will know the more that you learn the more places you go so basically this is just um something about reading okay it is just a quote and then um there is a button over here which says what read a book okay now if you scroll down um, we are displaying some you know um a great carousel over here okay so as you can see you can glance through or go through it using this arrows over here okay and this one um is just you know something like a featured thing a featured books over here okay just to let people know that these books are the most read books or whatever books that you want to what you want to tell people okay so that is it now if you scroll down we have um you know another session over here which also have a this session is all about what powerful motivation what books okay so an individual's thought have to, the ability to influence their actions blah 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 you can write any quote that you want to what right over here with a button over here okay so this is just a simple thing to design the what the home page and then we have all kinds of what books and their their prizes um their prizes over here so if you scroll on it um you can you know just click on it to, uh, to view the book itself and then you know you when you come down over here now we have the last um session over here which is a call to action over here which is uh, just one small positive thought in the morning can change your whole day so read a book so you know just one small reading in the morning from a, your favorite book can change your thoughts for the whole day or can change your mood for the whole day okay and that is what it so this is just um, a simple home page i created over here for what the library book now i'm going to take you through how you know the shop page um the library page also looks like now i call it a shop page because you can um, I use WooCommerce to uh, to develop it. Okay, so as you can see, this is what um, this is the the library page of a lot of books over here. You can what you can go through. Okay, so as you can see, when you hover on it, it says what borrow. Okay, borrow book. When you hover over it, it says what borrow book. When you hover over it, it says what borrow book. So I will show you how you can be able to what, change um, you know this default WooCommerce to what borrow book so that you also what. Um, you know change it to either download or whatever it is you can be able to, uh, to use it okay so this one this website over here can also be used as what a bookstore okay so for those of you who wants to what sell books and then you know whether um soft copy or um you know physical book you can use this website to, uh, to sell um your books okay so you can watch it create your own and then sell your books using this one but specifically this is what just for borrowing what book okay so as you can see um that is how it is now if i want to let's say um borrow um think and grow rich over here and read i can click over here okay and then i'll view the cart page so this is what i already have another book which is make your bed now i'm going to delete that this one and then i'll just use this one and then i'll proceed to what to check out okay so when we go to the checkout page now as you can see i don't have so many details going on here the only details i have is what 
your name the town the phone number and then your your email address i've removed all the other details from the um, you know the checkout page and then also as you can see the checkout page um, button doesn't say what it does not say place order it says what borrow okay so now i use the woocommerce you know um uh, plugin to develop this website but then i have to what uh, write some codes to be able to uh, get it down now i not specifically i wrote the code i i use chat gpt to help me to you know redefine it the way i want it okay so as you can see i'm what cash on day of what borrowing so you pay cash you pay with cash upon what borrowing and that is it okay so you don't need to what, worry yourself now as you can see you can go ahead and then what um you know fill in your name your details and then you click on what borrow and then you'll be able to what, borrow a book okay and that is it so um this is how the checkout page also look like now this is a simple about page i'm going to take you to the about page also this is a simple about page okay very simple it doesn't have so much going on over here and you see it over there and then um we also have um i've taken you through the library page i'm going to take you through the contact page also it's very simple contact page um just to uh, to get information from you know whoever owns the what the website okay if you want to contact the admin of the website you can use this contact form to, uh, to contact them and then the account what page this is where all the books that you borrowed will be seen at okay just like the way um, woocommerce normal woocommerce you know um, account page looks like it is also what the same but of course if you want to redesign this one to suit whatever you want it you can watch um a video i made about what how to design the woocommerce um you know woocommerce page woocommerce my account page using what using um elementor okay you can use that one to, to redesign your own page for yourself okay so basically that is it. now if you click on this one it will take you to the what to the library side okay all the uh, books over here so this is um basically how the website really looks like it it's not really much but then it have everything that you need to what um to be able to run this what this website now um at the admin side of the website it is the normal woocommerce so when somebody borrows um fill a name to borrow a book or what the you know the the admin or the owner of the website the library would do is to to um you know just when on the day of what borrowing on the day when the person comes to the to the library to what to collect the book you prepare the book down for the person when the person comes you just what you just give it to what give it to the person and you collect your what your borrowing fee or the money that the person is supposed to what use to what to borrow um you know the book okay now when the person you know returns the book you just record it in your what in your um in your in your in your log or whatever it is that you have to record it okay but basically this is how um the website really looks like it is basically for what recording all the borrowings that um goes on into the what into the library i hope this you know um if you like this t t um, introduction that i've done you can stick around and then you know watch the full tutorial how i did this particular what website if you are interested in it please hit the like button and then subscribe to the channel if you haven't turn on the notification button so that whenever i drop a video you'll be able to what you'll be able to um come and then watch it so um without wasting my time let's go straight into how we started designing this beautiful library website as you see over here